I fuck listen to me, bro. He gonna make me expose his ass. I've been trying to be cool. I fuck with Mozzie. Period. I don't know that dude right there, bro. I ain't never seen that nigga in my life. They reached for me and I kept it gangster with him. They was trying to get a deal with cash money, right? They was in conversation with Birdman. Birdman told him, why to run the cash money west side? Right? Boom. Birdman called me. Whack, boom, 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 boom. I told Birdman, I fuck with Mozzie. Whatever you try to decide to do, what you do is your company, my brother. But I fuck with Mozzie. I ain't fucking with that. And I left it at that. <clears throat> now, for whatever reason, wasn't no more business. So they called me. Actually, a nigga from Oakland. Uh, the nigga named Zoster. Zoster. Zoster the Roaster or some shit. Zoder Rosa. Yeah, Zoder Rosa. I know you talking about. That's he called me. Name. He called uh, me. Uncle, right? Uh, Look, he, he called my phone. His cousin. His cousin. cousin. He said, yeah, what? what? Anyway, we can make this right. I said, make what right? The thing, we trying to do this, do this, do this. We feel like you stopped the play. I didn't stop the play because I didn't start the play. What is it to get right? What the issue going on with... Uh, I don't even know this nigga name. What's your nigga name? The nigga Cash CML, money. man. Nah, yeah. nah, nah. Cash Cash money. Money. CML. We ain't gonna say the nigga full name. His name, 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 name is CML. He ain't no Cash Money Lavish. His hood. His hood. His hood. Yeah. His hood out there is Cash Money. That's what they know. Okay, well, listen. I want y'all to pay attention to this. I don't know nothing about this nigga. Pay attention to that, right? So I tell Zoda Roaster, well, it ain't no problem for me to get right. Well, you know, we feel like your relationship with Mozzie, well, my relationship with Mozzie is definitely going to be my relationship with Mozzie. That's my little nigga. My loyalty going to be to Mozzie. Nigga, my loyalty was with you. Would you not want me to tell Mozzie the same thing? There's crickets on the phone. Right. Mozzie ain't never told me not to fuck with the nigga. Mozzie ain't never had one conversation with me about this man. Mozzie don't even he say that nigga name. This man. He ain't brought this man name up or nothing. But it's this simple. I fuck with Mozzie. I don't know this nigga. So, nigga, if you supposed to be a real nigga, whoever this lavish, whatever the fuck his name is, right? Any Bob real Love, nigga could respect the fact, any real nigga could respect the fact that this man is aligned with your alleged op. So, if I'm aligned with your alleged op, and that's my little nigga, I fuck with him. I respect this man. If you a real nigga, you automatically know I can't fuck with you. Any real nigga know that, am I right? Stay like that. Yeah, no, that's true. That's Big a, fact. That's a hundred percent true. This ain't got this ain't got nothing to do, nigga. I don't know you. I ain't got nothing against you. But I fuck with this man right here. Me and this man is very close. We got a we already got a relationship. We, we got a relationship. Good. We got a working relationship. He's done things for me. I've done things for him. Personal things, business thing. I know his family. He know my family. Enough you know said. what I'm saying? Nigga been living in LA like five, six years. Nigga pulls up when he ain't got to, won't take no money from me. You know what I'm saying? Let me make money with him. At the end of the day, bro, I don't know what, what the fuck. Like, nigga, why is you that butthurt and emotional not to understand that this man already got a relationship with this man, bro? Already See, whack, 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 blood. See, whack, blood. Think it's a wanky doodle, blood. Wanky doodle. Now, where they got mad the at, let me tell you, Chuck, where they got mad at. He did a Mozzie yeah. Dish song about a year ago, right? Yeah, that bullshit ass Where Waldo. Listen, I stopped Mozzie. Mozzie did a diss song back. I went in the studio and deleted the motherfucker. Stopped him from putting it out. They know I stopped him from putting it out. They got mad and said, why'd you do that? I said, because I fuck with Mozzie. And I'm going to advise him, nephew. The nigga hating on you because of who you are in the game. Your fans don't pay him no attention. The minute you bite into that and drop, you now your fans is going to pay him some attention. Nigga, the all the war, nigga, is to destroy on every level. Um, you can't put that out. Mozzie didn't talk to me for two, three months. He was mad at him up. I deleted the whole files, everything. Call then he me. called hey, me what? and said, Unc. He called me and said, Unc, I thought about it. 
I'm glad I didn't put it out you right. He said, I need more niggas like you around me, young, because you, you didn't give a fuck that even though I wasn't talking to you, wasn't returning your calls, you never sent me a fucked up text message. You never got mad, said nothing. I said, you know, that's what I'm here for. That's the real definition of a G homie to you. That's right. You know what I mean? So, oh, you know. Oh. And and then they called me. I think I spoke thing. on it. I spoke on it and said, the diss track will not be responded to. I deleted it. I stopped it from coming out. They called me. Yo, Wack, why you do that? Nigga, didn't I tell you I fucked with Mozzie? And they quit to say you always instigating some bullshit. You just killed some. Hey, yeah, Wack. I said... But yeah, Mozzie don't even need to respond. Like, like that shit would like, like don't. you said, that would be irrelevant. He, like, he already said what he had to say. Like, Wanky Doodle won the blood and the bounty. He was a crip. Like, leave that little nigga. Alone. He did. He didn't respond. On, so Bobby, don't I don't know. understand you why he's so nigga. tripping. Mozzie live in L.A. Dude live in Texas, bro. Ain't nobody even in Sacramento. What, what niggas is tripping on? Mozzie live down here with us, bro. He drive Lambos down here every day. Go wherever he want to. Chris Bloods, we love him to death. He pull up, we support us, we support him. He needed that you know this song to come out. That's why he was mad. Mozzie, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, out here in LA, that nigga Mozzie is that nigga. That's for sure, for sure. Yeah, everybody love him to death. He a good dude, he's a genuine good dude. So, dude in Texas, so if you in Texas and Mozzie in LA, what you talking about beefing the Sacramento for? At what point in time, nigga, are you going to embrace your craft? And make it about what you could do and your skill set for your fans. Y'all not in sack. Ain't y'all not doing nothing to each other in Sacramento. So I, that should be over with. Niggas don't those niggas rap. got a real beef though? It ain't no rap shit. Yeah. No, that's yeah, real yeah, beef, yeah, beef, my nigga. Yeah, like bro, nigga, that's that's, that's, yeah, that's, that's 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 politics. Nigga, can't nobody stop that. Yeah, 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 but, yeah but that's, that's, that's more of a reason. That's more of a reason for niggas not to be doing no records, man. It, nigga, it's shit. It's blood shit over there. Lavish D music hard too. He got a couple slappers, just a couple. Man, quit yeah, his, 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 his music hard, but like all his shit things start that Mozzie though. So that, that, that's yeah, but he not, he not fucking with the mozzarella fella. <laughs> nigga, the mafioso, <laughs> the hell gang. Hey, but what niggas keep forgetting? What niggas keep forgetting? Uh, that uh, CML nigga, the reason why he got on. Nigga, when he made that diss run, bro. he made that diss record. Nigga, that's the reason why he got you on. Know, you know, he, one of niggas that he can he can say uh, one punchline on a nigga, bro, and kill a career at this point. He ain't got to say uh, too much. He no more. did no, already, he, bro. What are we talking about? Hey, you said who the reason why who got on? I got to think about that first song that Mozzie had, tell you, telling the truth. That was the first debut of Mozzie. That was the first motherfucker. That was the first time y'all ever heard of Mozzie when he when he made that tell the truth. When he said when he when he uh when he when he was talking about uh um uh, uh Lav and uh, uh uh and his brother and all the little shit. Yep. That was the first debut. Nah, nigga, that was for the nigga. The outside this nigga, not for no Cali niggas, bro. For sure. Cali niggas been here about Mozzie. All I know is I fuck with Mozzie. That's my little partner. If another nigga want to get mad that I didn't uh, uh, disrespect one of my little partners, then nigga, you just got to be mad. Y'all fuck wrong with this nigga. What whack do to you, nigga? Well, I'm happy you chose a legend. Because Mozzie a legend. I wouldn't say that. Yeah, don't say that. He still got yeah, some ain't shit like to a do. low tier rapper. He worked. Yeah, at the end he, of the day, know, that's between the two. Legend, he's a Bay legend. He's a, he he's, he's a Sacramento legend. Nah, he's, he's from the Bay. He's not from the Bay. Sack, sack, one bad sack. He's more of a Sacramento legend. He's an Oak Park legend. He's the biggest thing. He's the biggest thing. Wait. He's the biggest thing that came out of Sack. He's the biggest thing that then came out of Sack. That's why I think Keep grinding and keep working and keep turning in and building his body of work. He definitely a good. I don't even think he half of what he going to turn into. He right where YG was before YG crossed over and went and started doing shit with Young Jeezy them in the South. He right in that root. All he got to do is cross over and he going to go. I thought hey, brother can was a, a big thing versus YG I didn't know that. What? Can we get a game versus YG uh, verse for the coaches? A game what? Game versus YG. Like a verse, like a nigga. Verse. Hell like no, verse. bro. That shit wouldn't even Versus. last long. What type of shit is that? What type of question is that? Everybody the catalog don't even line up. 
Put her in no, the bed. I, I know the catalog don't. don't uh, the game wouldn't even get past documentary. Be like new school versus old school. Yeah, there ain't no match. You gotta pick, Corny, you you gotta pick two different out. people. <laughs> Devil Cloud chases those. Shout out. The Come on, man. What's how they get to start from scratch? It's over with. These dudes just want to I ain't say why these going to win. I already know the game's going to win. I just think for the culture wise, I think it'd be kind of dope. You got to do something that's competitive, though. You can't do something you know yeah, somebody's going to win. No flop side. So you got to yeah. think brotherly chum put put Sacramento on the map. Chuck Taylor. Y'all know, Chuck. Um, I really, I see did more than brother like Lynch on. You say what, bro? I what see you say, what? Clip, he was talking about. He was like talking. After watching that Soldier Boy versus, I don't even think YG got Soldier Boy. The, the nigga CM man, whatever, not, 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 not Lavery, 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 whatever nigga name is. Yeah, yeah. He was on the clip saying, "We out here for real, nigga. This ain't no internet shit and all this shit." So I'm looking at the clip right, and I'm telling myself. Well, if it ain't no internet shit, why the fuck you on the internet? <laughs> Good question. Yeah, he did <laughs> say that. He did say that. He doing his I mean, I'm saying, bro, I, I don't know, but only thing I'm saying, bro, is every man has a right to deal with who he want to deal with. I don't know that man. Only thing I know is him and Mozzie got some kind of conflict. What? I don't know. I don't even know what gang do from, right? So based upon they got conflict, I fuck with Mozzie. Therefore, I'm never going to do that kind of business because it's conflicting with my relationship and my loyalty to Mozzie. That's it. Am hey, I looking what? for Lavish D did. to do something to him? No, I'm not. Man, hey, politics. If you pull up, if you pull up hey. on Mozzie and I'm there, nigga, I'm riding with Mozzie. Politics, I'm telling you. Hey, Wack, he did. He did one of them. Um, he did one of them little skits one time. Remember, I was telling you about it. He had asked for you to set the fade up. I don't know if he was trying to do that celebrity boxer shit, but he look, called. Bro. Called. I'm the you. king. Listen, listen, bro. I'm the king of disregard. You, Rambo, you are not going to manipulate Cash Jones. Not gonna happen. You fighting two niggas. You fighting the ignorant nigga and the thinking nigga. Lil Wack is ignorant. Wack 100 is going to embarrass you because that's just social media. Cass Jones is the brains. Depending on how I want to deal with you, I'm going to mix you up with. I see niggas coming a mile away. Set up a fight for what, nigga? Fight for what? We'll fight my, for what? It's past fight. I thought you say his own. It's on, nigga. Let it be on. That a fight really, Instagram a clippers. fight really is a form of respect, my nigga. Exactly. Well, if you telling me it's on and bodies and all this shit that went on, nigga, let it be on. Nigga. Yeah, that's it, man. Like niggas be taking shit too personal, hey, bro. Uh, you know they did a song from jail with uh Napoleon, the homie Napoleon, though. Who was that nigga? I never heard it. How long? Who was that nigga? The, uh... Who was Napoleon? Nah, 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 nah. From nah. the Outlaws? I mean, from the, from the Outlaws? His name to Tiny Pool or something like that. Who was that nigga? I've never seen that nigga in my life. Who? <laughs> what? Killing me, bro. I've never seen this man no, in my life. He went He went in there with... uh. I know exactly went in there for the ride car. in the back car with Rooster on there. Exactly. He was in the back seat, right? The nigga paroled. He called my phone from the pen. Who was this? Tiny Pooh. I don't know no Tiny Pooh. I don't acknowledge or recognize a Tiny Pooh. Get off my phone. Click. Hang up. He get out. He out. He been out. I don't know. I've never Rambo. I've never seen this dude in my life. See, you, Rambo, got to understand. Dog, if you ain't one of them ones, I don't even acknowledge you, bro. If you ain't my G homie, meaning you called me cash because before you called me Lil Wack, I'm not acknowledging you. If you didn't come up, you came up in my era, and you wasn't putting in work, I'm not acknowledging you. 
I don't give a fuck about a nigga getting dressed up real good with tattoos talking about he from the hood. I, that ain't what I do. Use a to witness. That's it? Yeah, you got the address over there? All right. Right? So uh, I don't acknowledge niggas like that. So just, that's it. You know, Blood did a diss song on Pooh and didn't want to face Pooh when he got out. I don't Eddie. know. Dead homies. I yeah, took food. that name from inside the stoop. Because on the street, oh, yeah. shit, we just know him by his real name. So, shit. That tell you what it is. What's up, Pop? See, dude. Hey, what up? Sausage. You just said you wanted to be a pescatarian. So, put it down. Hey, who, who playing that music? Who that? Playing that sexy ass music. That nigga, that nigga was playing the weekend. No, that definitely wasn't the weekend, but it will mess up the mess up the show. <laughs> ATM popping music on all platforms is better than that shit. <laughs> <laughs> the last weekend album was trash. Hey, it's hey, like Bobby, you just have to. Meditate. Who's the weekend signed to? EXO is EXO. Yeah, I heard girls are saying that's, they, that's the best album that new weekend album. That's they, I heard that was their best shit. Nah, oh, his best shit. nah, uh, his, his best one. shit. His best shit was his last one, or or I think that was his first one, the one that had that uh, often on it. Nah, that wasn't his first really one. His best like album was trilo- the trilogy. Trilogy. What is the code yeah. shit? I'm a motherfucking star boy. No copyrights. Damn, everybody was excited like a Well, Snow, man. check that email. I sent you a couple joints. I thought I hit a dead spot or something. I'm out here in traffic. Hey. Good. 18 to pop. I need music coming out, dog. You said what? We get music coming out, bro. Now on all platforms, but I'm dropping the, uh, I'm dropping the project. I'm dropping a project in a few days. Check the PTR. That's a new single. Yo, Papa, you gotta, you gotta stop posting talking? shit. You gotta stop putting the links up. You gotta stop. You know what I mean? Yeah. Man, you you talk, do, talk, you talk, talking about yeah, on Clubhouse yeah, or yeah, just in general? Yeah, I don't even know who was talking. He said, "Check the PTR, man." You know how many people on this fucking stage? Yo, man. So, so <laughs> nah, somebody was so just talking to me. Everybody got this thing with Bobby Smurda dancing and shit, right? So it's ballet dancers that go home to their wife and kids and they wear tights. Are they gay or funny looking or look that funny because they yep. do their craft? Hey, bro. They don't portray that. Hey, bro. Ballet, nigga.